I've got a potential new carry gun here. I've got a whole bunch of hollow point ammunition loaded up into a bunch of magazines. Now, I'm actually gonna load up a few more magazines as this goes, actually reuse these, because we're about to do a 100 round hollow point reliability test on this Springfield XDS nine millimeter four inch gun. Now, what I always recommend to people is that you go out and you shoot at least a couple hundred rounds of ball ammunition, and you shoot at least 50 rounds of hollow point ammunition, the exact hollow point ammunition that you're going to want to carry out of any gun before you decide to actually carry it. So again, we've got the XDS Springfield 9mm 4-inch. These are stock sights, a stock two-tone gun. Nothing special has been done to the gun. We've shot, like I said, about 1,200 rounds probably total through it or less, somewhere between 1,000 1,200 rounds. And now I've probably got about, I don't know, 50 rounds of this through it so far, but we're going to go for 100 rounds in a row right now. Obviously, we're going to make sure that we get magazines in there, we get that round racked, we're going to look at slide lock. We're going to go ahead and shoot the gun through that 100 rounds. I'm going to have to reload. I've got a box down here with a few more rounds. And here we go. 100 round reliability test with hollow point ammunition through the Springfield XDS 9mm 4 inch model. Time to reload. We are uh, moving forward. We had 37 last time, so that is a total of, uh, quick math, 74 rounds at the end of these magazines. And another reload. We've got 74, that's 26 more rounds to go. All right, so that is nine more, 16, seven is 23. So I need three rounds loaded into this magazine. One, two, three, actually. All right, so that gives us, finish that magazine, we will be at 100 rounds. And there you have it, 100 rounds, slide lock on that last one. I have noticed that in shooting this gun, a couple of things. One, I tend to drop down a little bit low. I uh, had a few shots here early, so I had to consciously point the gun up a little bit higher. Obviously, I wasn't using my sights here at this range, shooting at this size target, so that's something to get used to with this gun. Recoil management was great, absolutely no problem there. I was playing around with my thumb a little bit, trying to find the right place. Anytime you pick up a new gun, you might find that your thumb may or may not ride on that slide lock. In early testing, I found that my thumb was riding on that slide stop, and I wasn't always getting slide lock. You saw that out of, I don't know, whatever that was, about 12 to 15 magazine changes, I had one situation where my thumb was on that slide lock. If I'm going to carry that gun, that's going to be something I'm going to need to work on. But as far as the reliability of the gun, absolutely 100%. This 100 round test that I do is pretty significant. It's an integrity test. And this Springfield XDS 9mm 4 inch, which is a little bit warm to the touch right now, absolutely 100% passed. I'm excited about that. I know a lot of people are excited about this gun being on the market. and. Uh, for some people, this is going to make a great carry gun. Single stack, 9 millimeter, 9 rounds plus 1 with the extended magazine, 7 rounds plus 1 with the flush, which of course is how most people are going to carry it to take advantage of that short grip. Springfield XDS, 9 millimeter, 4 inch, absolutely a gun on the recommended list for Rob Pincus and ICE Training Company.